Tides roll. What's happening, man? Keith, nice to meet you, sir. Keith. So, uh, Keith, where are you from? I am from Martinsburg, West Virginia. Okay, and we're sitting here in... You know Martinsburg? We're sitting here in Lynchburg, Virginia, playing tonight where? Phase, Virginia. Phase two. Phase two. And you're from where? Martinsburg, West Virginia. How far is that? Uh, 69 miles west of Baltimore. I drove about three hours to get here. Oh, that's easy to remember. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, man. So do you work at a record store? Or? I have been a deputy sheriff for 27 years. Oh. But I am an avid vinyl hound. Like nice. Yourself, kiss fanatic. Very like, cool. Like yourself. Uh-huh. Um, so um, we are having a... Uh, I have a vinyl page on, on Facebook. Um, we hold the largest single day metal sale in the world. Wow. Uh, based on pure volume. It's called Super Metal Sunday. Um, we're going to do some promo stuff for, for that. You are going to be the special guest. Okay. Okay. For that, I have brought you presents. Right on. A lot of presents. Okay. Okay. Let's so let's, let's do this. So, wow. first of all, we, we have a <laughs> bag of that is. goodies yeah, for you. So do I. Well, even so, the bag is cool. Yeah, yeah, so, that's <laughs> do you have number one, Johnny Lightning? Yes, I have these. Okay. That's awesome, though. Okay. But that's cool, man. So, I have brought, also oh brought you. Oh, my God. Original. Oh, jeez. Look at that. A Gene Simmons songbook. songbook. Yeah. Unbelievable. That's really Do you really, have that? No, I don't. Well, you do now. Well, that is awesome. <laughs> Ace Frehley. And an Ace song book. Song book. Oh, my God. Does this have this? Hang on. Look at that That's shit. Great. Those are great shots. Dude, thank you so much. Oh, we're not. We haven't even started yet. Right? <laughs> we haven't even started yet. Barry Levine. That's amazing. Amazing. So, I also have some traveling music now, for you. Now, can I have the bag, too? Or? Hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you're killing me. Here. <laughs> you are going to get the bag. So, yes. Thank you. The bag for you. The now, bag you know that is the original an original solo album bag. Solo bag. Yeah. Amazing. Music so, Plus. Okay. So, we also have some traveling music for you while you're on Whoa, tour Whoa, made in Japan? Uh, well, this is made in Japan, but this is the entire show. Jeez. Okay, that's not, that's not a that's, authorized. I don't, I don't have that. This is album quality, soundboard, no way. piano, the entire show. So, this is like the same made in Japan, but with the rest of the songs. Correct. Unbelievable. Correct. Thank you, dude. I love that. That is yours. That is really cool. Um, We have some... Uh, Led Zeppelin promo stuff for you. Wow, we'll be coming up on our 50th anniversary. <laughs> well, you know it. Alright, so, <laughs> guess I'll get the big fish out of the way first. <laughs> because when I set this up with Rob, I told him I would be very appreciative to have you as a guest on our metal selling event. <laughs> I've spent half my life literally looking for this album. I found it. And if there's anybody in the world that I could give it to, it would be you. Okay? Yeah. So this is okay. this is a four to five hundred this is a four to five hundred dollar original radio promo for the release of the of the double platinum album. It's called A Taste of Platinum. This is oh one of the holy grails in the world of KISS Vinyl. How many of you think that those were pressed? I see. don't know. I have literally searched for this half of my life. So you only have one? Yeah. And you're giving me your only one? I am. Okay, that's really sick. I am. I am. I am. I'm. I. I really don't know what to Start say. Start to sweat, man. <laughs> you know what? If Excalibur. I, if I if I conquistador. <laughs> if I wasn't such a fan and a vile collector. I would not take this, but, but I am. <laughs> I know how big of a, I knew there was a, a vinyl hound coming. you are. I know how big of a kiss hound I you are. I can't even thank you enough because I've never even seen this record. Can well, you tell me where you got it? I I can. I actually just told the story out in, out in the parking lot a couple minutes ago. Mm hmm. Well, and there, what, where did you get this? There is a biannual record convention in Washington, D.C. Okay. called the D.C. Record Fair, 
Um, I was there a couple years ago. Um, I really wasn't finding anything that day that I liked. So I'm upstairs and I'm flipping through a random box an older gentleman had of uh, 12 inch DJ singles, stuff like yeah. that. Flipping, flipping, flipping. Something caught my eye and I was like, no. This was. Play. <laughs> I flipped back, I pulled it up, my hand started to shake. <laughs> so cool. No, this is really, really cool. Five dollars I paid. For. No way. Five. Now I don't feel so bad. <laughs> <laughs> I could not get five dollars out of my five pocket. Five bucks. Enough. That's all he wanted. He had no idea. He had no. Clue. No idea. My inner self wanted to go on what I do for a living. Wanted to say, "Pardon me, sir, you're making a big mistake." But you know, like the scene off uh, the Animal House movie, the devil yes. on one shoulder and the angel I on the know, other. I just felt that myself. I got the angel and went. Yeah, me too. And I, uh, I took it. <laughs> well, you know, dude, here. I am amassing an insane record collection, but specifically Kiss. And someday, you know, I'm going to kick the bucket. And these are all going to be part of one collection that's going to be remarkable. Like it already is. And to have this as part of it and documented on the internet, this will be part of of my collection and it will be cherished nothing will happen to it that is and, why i'm giving it uh, to it's going to be in perfect condition well. and it's going to go with all the other rare kiss records so somebody someday other than me if this will be passed on we don't really own me records we just we just are in possession we don't own of we're we're you're in right, possession for a little while then yeah. it goes to someone else yeah this will go to someday someday this might go to somebody else it's going to go to me. Yeah, it might go to you if you give me that Cruise magazine. <laughs> well, I can't take it We're not done. What? We're not done. You got nothing that can top this. I mean, I can be done. I'm sure you No, 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 no. Let's not be done. Let's not be done. And my phone rings. Okay, that's not good on the video. <laughs> so, we also have, I don't know if you have this. What? So this is an original yellow pressing <laughs> of... Uh, I was no made for loving you back way. with charisma. What? <laughs> Twelve inch disco. A vinyl. yellow vinyl. Yeah. What up? Charisma. What? And this is just from Mexico. I believe so. Oh my lord. I think that actually was the only country that that version was released in. <laughs> That's cool. It's almost lime green. Dude. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I've never even heard of this. I've never even heard of this. You have it now. What? Well, Tom Shannon, kiss my wax. You guys can kiss my wax today, man. <laughs> that is crazy. I know. I've never even seen that. Okay, where did you get that? Couldn't tell you. You don't. You can't remember. I know. I collect so so much. Oh, so that was <gasps> great. That was oh, great. That yeah, was let's great. Not Nothing will ever crack happen crack to it. Crack Nothing crack it. Nothing will ever happen to it. You should put it in my record Wait, no, box. No, no, we'll put it right here. We'll put it right here. Put it right here. Put it right here. Okay. I was trying to make a display. So, we have... Unbelievable. All right. <laughs> this I'm going to have trouble parting with as well. But, from one kiss freak to another, we have a true, original Japanese destroyer. Vinyl, jacket, near mint, <laughs> Japanese booklet. Is the poster in there? It does not have the poster. Okay, that's it cool. It does have the Japanese the booklet. Lyric book, though. Oh, my God. <laughs> Rob, your friend can come to any show he wants, <laughs> anytime. The poster is super rare, huh? Which one was that? The one where they're on the like they're sit sitting on in their destroyer costumes or sitting like four. I used to have that on my wall, and me and my ex-wife got in a fight, and she ripped it. No, that was. Maybe That's, I'll edit that out of the that video. Was <laughs> end of the relationship. <laughs> So, so I think I might have like a piece of it still. So really? I don't know. So we got one more for you, young man. Oh my god. We gosh. have an original Japanese forty five. What? Of, what? of I <laughs> mint condition. Oh my lord. Actually Holy Star. I don't believe that has ever been played. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, man. I don't know what to tell you. Other than thank you very much. That's really killer. I don't. I mean, as a collector, that's really a mind-blowing 
days yeah, that's top for me, man. Yeah. I'm really blown away. Thank you so much. Not a problem. Looking Thanks forward to the record fair. What's it called? It is uh, called Super Metal Sunday. Super Metal Sunday. It is on a Facebook-only page called the Record Cassette and CD Asylum. We call ourselves the Asylum for short. There we but go. But the event is October 27th. It is all metal all day long. Nothing else is allowed to be sold Very except cool. metal. Sweet. Our, Be there. Our last host for this event was Ripper Owens, Udu, Dirk Schneider, and Lita Ford. Wow. And now we have Mr. Boz. Yes, I'm not going to be there, but I'm no. <laughs> talking about it to you here now. That's me. Hi. Thank you. And, of course, we have shirts for you, too. Very cool. Sweet. Can always use black T-shirts in a rock band. Inside out. Sweet. Thank you so much. I don't even know what to say, man. This is